Hey, what's up YouTube? Andy here from the Wet Shaving Store, coming at you with another shave, all right? This is a, a shave, we're actually doing this live too, right now on Instagram. Um, so if you're watching on Instagram, thanks for tuning in. We're shaving with Algorithm, a collaboration so between Shave Tech and Hendrix Classics and Company. It's an amazing, amazing soap. Uh, and the set on this is inspired by Armani Code. Gentlemen, if you haven't smelled this, this is an absolute banger. And it's a great, great, great um, scent for the summertime. It's a great citrusy, bright, and very sophisticated fragrance. So, stay so tuned. our shave today is with Algorithm. You guys have already seen this before. This is a collaboration between Shave Tech and the Wet Shaving Store, as well as um, Hendrix Classics and Company. Uh, the fragrance on this is inspired by, or it's really a dupe of Armani Code. You can see the pore there. That's Algorithm. And yeah, I've used it several times. Ah, oh, so good, so good, so good. All right, so we're gonna be using that. And for my blade, I got this Gillette 365 right here. It's Gillette 365. I don't know if you guys have seen these. They're nice, nice little blades, inexpensive, great little shavers. Um, I'm using my uh, Mercure 34C, trusty. You guys know I love this thing. It's my favorite. So I'm gonna go ahead and use that. And of course, we're gonna finalize it with Algorithm uh, Splash and the EDP. And for my brush, we got that Nameless Shaveworks brush right there, guys. Look at that, Nameless Shaveworks. You guys haven't seen these. Uh, Look at this, that lather guard feature right there. It's just amazing. Hey, what's up, Matthew? Uh, Redleg1963, Joe, what's up? And you got, this is a, G, a G5C knot, guys, G5C knot. So, excellent here, we'll get started with that. And of course, got my Captain's Choice bowl. So let's go ahead and get this shave going. Got my, my soap here, my little scooper. Scoops them out. Let's see. There we go. It's a good amount, right? Cool. Let's put that aside. Put it over here on my bowl. Pressing it in. Pressing it into the bowl. So I'm gonna go ahead and wet the brush real quick. All right, nameless to algorithm. Here we go. I'm gonna work this up a little bit right here. So have you guys been, man? What's everybody up to? Today's Saturday, it's been a busy week, guys. Busy, busy week. Um, this week was Nico's first week of school ever. All right, ever, ever, ever. So it's been a very interesting, interesting uh, week for us. You know, we're just adjusting, getting used to a new schedule, getting Nico um, into school, you know, getting him into the new routine. Um, we're pre we've been pretty lucky. Nico's been doing really well um, starting school. Um, so yeah, like I was saying, we, we've you know, the week has been a little bit rough for us just because we're starting a new schedule. Our, our son, he's our four-year-old son, Nico. Um, he's starting school for the first time ever. Um, and that's been fun. It's just been fun, you know, getting, getting him, you know, getting him up early, getting ready and doing all that stuff. Um, so been a busy, busy week, but we're enjoying it. We're enjoying it. So just working up the ladder over here, guys. Uh, I start off with a very, very small amount of water, just whatever was in the brush. I, I literally just held the brush over the um, over the sink and let it just, you know, do its thing. Yeah, what's up, what's up? All right, I'm gonna add a little more water to this because it needs some. Just gonna open the water hose right under it. Water hose, the, the water faucet. And then let's, let's get this a little bit more hydrated, all right? We need to hydrate it, a more hydrated soap because it's definitely bubbly, but when you, once you add a little bit of water, it just really starts to build that lather. If you want that beautiful lather, you guys know how we do it here. But, uh, I will show you what the lather looks like in just a minute here. And of course, we're just working it up right here. All right, um, have you guys, did you guys see my post um, about the, the clearance bin being uh, updated? We updated our clearance bin. A lot of people have been grabbing a lot of great deals, guys. Just a lot of a lot of um, you know uh, soaps and splashes that that have been in stock for a while, and we just need to get get them out. Pretty much, we gotta uh, make space for new stuff. Um, so we have some some really really like amazing deals. Probably the lowest price you'll ever see on some of that stuff, like Pinnacle Grooming, Gentleman's Nod, um, and just a few other things. Some Murphy and McNeil stuff is there as well. So yeah, if you're in the in the market for some of that stuff, go check it out. Um, you might get a really, really good deal. A really incredible deal um, while it lasts. Just 
because obviously those prices are not uh, permanent prices. Those are just for the stock that we've had and we need to move. We need to make space for the new stuff. Lots of new stuff coming in, uh, lots of new projects and yeah. All right, so I think this lather is pretty much done. Look at that. Looks pretty good, right? <laughs> Amazing, awesome. All right, so uh, let me load up my blade. I haven't loaded my blade yet. So like I said, if you guys missed it earlier, I have the Mercur 34C and I have this Gillette 365 razor right here. Uh, and the blade, just picked up a couple of sets yesterday. Awesome, yeah, thanks Shape Trooper. I know there, there's really good deals, guys. Um, I can't stress that enough. Uh, I hope you guys pick one up just because it's a deal and you're probably not gonna get, there's some, there's some things in there that are generally a little bit more expensive. So um, those things don't move on their own um, regularly. So, um, they're, on, they're on clearance, so we'll get a deal. All right, uh, you guys have seen this probably. I started testing these out. I'm really enjoying this bottle. I've never used it before. So let's go ahead and wet the face. Great, great, great. All right, let's get some of that lather on there. Look at that. Oh man. On the scent, guys. It's just the scent. The scent is just marvelous, marvelous. I love this. Armani Code, I mean, that's kind of a classic fragrance there, guys. If you haven't smelled it before, um, you might be living a little bit under rock just because it's a great, great fragrance. Um, it's not new by any means. You know, it hasn't, it's been out for many years. So if you haven't tried it out, and of course, if you know anything about uh, George Armani, great banger scents, you know, the creator of um aqua de geo so armani code comes from that same house the, the house of armani and it's great 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 stuff yeah by the way if you got you guys know hey demetrios what's up hags demetrios from hags has joined the live um for those of you watching after the fact you guys don't know this but there's a secondary camera come recording on top this is also going to become a youtube video so if you're watching from youtube right now in the future thank you so much for tuning in um we do these live as well or try to do them live you know we try different things all the time so we'll see how this works out if this works out we'll keep doing more of this it's a live video but we're also recording a youtube video um while we're doing this so let's get that going of course we'll edit that later and that'll be up that'll be posted hopefully by monday or something like that um but anyways all right nice and lathered there no pre-shave today i should have used it because it's sitting right here next to me. I got the Cremo Original uh, Shaving Cream, but this is an excellent, excellent pre-shave, guys. Uh, excellent pre-shave here. We have a great deal on this, a full kit for $19.99. And actually, if you use the code CREMO, you get an additional $3 off. You get the, the razor, the, the, the full cream, the full-size cream, 90-day supply is what they say there. And then you also get the post-shave cooling with menthol. If you like menthol, balm. Excellent for the, for the summer. All right, let's get the shave going. Mercur 34C, first pass. Here we go. Oh man, this is so satisfying when you've had, well for me it's about three days of growth now. I was supposed to shave a couple days ago, but you know, time, time. Man, so satisfying just like, you know, mowing it off. Mowing off the, all of the growth. And yep. Demetrius from Hags is in the house. Guys, if you guys haven't if you guys haven't tried the new Hags the new Hags bases, Osiris and Hathor, you gotta try it out. You absolutely have to try it out because they're they're amazing. Amazing, amazing uh bases. Uh Demetrios really, really you guys know he's committed to quality and and excellence. So, I mean, there's there's nothing short of, of spectacular, those two bases. And of course, if you haven't checked out Dark Knight, which is the collaboration between Hags and the wet shaving store, Dark Knight um, is available. Step away, here it is. Look at that, there goes Hags. Dark Knight, this is um, inspired by Parfums de Marly uh, Percival, guys. Oh, man. Excellent, excellent. I, I love that fragrance, by the way. I mean, if I haven't said it enough, it's one of my favorites. And we, you know, we asked for that when we did this collaboration with Demetrios, and he absolutely killed it. So, 
Thank you, Demetrios, for that. Let's get this on here. Mm-hmm. Shaman. All right. First pass, down. First pass, down. Beautiful. Great, great razor. Super, uh, obviously, the McCurt that we see is a, a nice, mild shaver. But this this blade here, guys, nice and smooth. Um, these are marketed as great, you know, for a one-pass shave, I guess. Or not one-pass, but one shave. Um, I've used them for at least two or three, and I've had no problem. But great little little shavers. A little tuck is a dollar. Um, but we have, obviously, many of these. So if you haven't grabbed these, these come from India, guys, by the way. All right, let's wet the face oh i gotta get used to using it see I'm, I'm used to just opening the faucet putting hand putting water in my hands and splashing it over my face but now that i have this thing um and yeah i like it so i think I, i'm gonna be bringing some of these to the wet shaving store um this is such a not i get it now i get why people like this so much um it's nice and it, it does a great job and the distribution is really good which is the best part like you know you make sure it really sprays the water and the coverage that it gives you is is great my first new base, awesome. Oh, you're gonna love it, dude. That one's in the Hathor base. The Hathor base, um, Dark Knight is in the Hathor base, Rob. So it's absolutely fantastic, man. I'm telling you, I'm telling you, I'm telling you. And the creaminess on that base is is great. Really, really great. I love it. And that's, that's Dark Knight we're talking about, Rob. Andy is bougie now. I know, man, I got that bougie sprayer. Look at that. And it feels good. <laughs> They're not very expensive either, so we're gonna, you know, bring them in and, you know, whoever wants them, wants them. And what do you guys think? So this is like the 200 milliliter size, but they also sell like really big ones. In my opinion, for us shavers, we only need like the smallest size. We don't need like anything bigger than this. But what do you think? Should I bring in multiple sizes, like different sizes, or just this size right here, which is 200 ml? It's also available in white. I have it. Uh, I think Nico took it to his restroom, um, and it's available in white too. What do you guys think? Sizes, multiple sizes, or just the the two hundred ml one? Oh yeah. All right, we're gonna do the second pass, and I think the second pass will be my last pass because I like my hair growing a little bit quicker, a little bit faster. If I if I do a BBS, it takes a little bit longer for. For me to do my next shave and come on you guys know i enjoy this hobby a lot I, I love i love shaving so um anyway anything i can do to increase the the, the the rate of growth of my hair or you know i guess just not cut it down as much so i can shave again i'll, I'll try to do that you know i'll try to do that all right here we go all right joe take it easy man here we go against the grain second pass Yeah, nice and smooth. Very nice, nice and smooth. That's right. That's right. So Harry, Harry says that the smaller sizes on the on the bougie sprayers are, it's more than enough, you know, just because we don't use that much water as shavers, and then of course we shake, we we swap out the water each time anyway. So no need for a thousand milliliters. Or even 400 for that matter. 200 milliliters is more than enough. There it is. So smooth. I love this razor. <laughs> the number Kurt 34C. It's just my favorite razor. Why? Because of the, the effortless shave that I get with this. Don't only have to think about it. And the results are always great. Effortless, effortless. What I mean by effortless is that I can just be less careful, right? Because when you're using... Hey, what's up, DJ Chubbs? What's up, William? Thanks for joining in, brother. Um, you guys know that when... 
when I say it's a more effortless shave, it's just that I'm not, I don't have to be as careful because when you're using something that's a little bit more aggressive, obviously I'm, I'm gonna be more careful, just you know, making sure I'm not accidentally slicing, slicing my face, right? All right, I think we're good. I'm gonna do a couple of pickups. I'm just gonna wet the face a little bit here. So you just, I got something here. like my problem area right here look see that pimple always there it's annoying super annoying i can't i can't stand this thing and i've been putting all kinds of treatments on it and does not seem to want to budge it's very very stubborn so i'm always really careful over here but anyways we got it all right i'm gonna rinse the face really quick so give me a second here second Check it out. My Lancaster Shave Works towel. What's going on? I'm gonna see what, uh, no, no he probado la, la, the Mueller R89, uh, el R89 de Mueller. Yo sé que mucha gente dice que es bien agresiva, pero no, nunca la he probado. The R89, you know, it's always touted as a very, very aggressive razor. Um, Andres from Mexico is from uh, the shaving ritual shaving MX. Um, he's asking about the, if I've tried it, but I haven't. It says, "Is the sprayer not continuous misting when you spray once?" Uh, it is. It is. So this one. So the way this works, this is not battery operated, guys. And this was really interesting to me. One second. Let me put this away. So the way this 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 thing works is basically there's a little. There's a little like air tube inside, all right? And it builds up when you spray, what it does is it actually just builds up pressure. And then that pressure um, basically forces the water out in a stream. There's obviously, it's, it's being forced through a very, very small um, orifice. And then when you spray it, I don't know, I don't know if it'll come through, but I can, I can just like, see, it keeps spraying. I press it and it keeps spraying. You can see my hand there, it's full of water. So you press, and then if you keep pressing, It'll just keep going. It'll just keep going. I was going to spray the water. But anyways, that's how it works. It, it's not battery operated. It's mechanical. And it's just that breath. The pressure that builds up inside is what causes the water to shoot out. And as the pressure is being slowly released from, you know, the small um, small dispenser, the orifice, whatever you want to call it, um, then it slowly comes out and it basically creates a continuous, a continuous spray. And if you keep building the pressure, then it keeps spraying. So great stuff yeah 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 so i did so you can't do that too when i did do that so i just did like when i was doing the pickups i just did like you know small sprays but if you want to do the whole you, you really have to engage it all the way in in order to get the you know the long sprays okay let me dry the face one more time now i got water on me change the water every two weeks yep or or every time you shave, really, if you want, if you're like me, so let's uh, put this over here. Okay, let's go. Let's hit it with that algorithm aftershave splash. You guys can see it here. I'm putting it over here. Algorithm. Look at that. That label, man. Look at that label. I know. Splash it up. Smell bomb. Smell bomb. Hmm. Ooh. Beautiful. Oh yeah, this HCNC splash is really nice. Gives you a nice post shave feel. I can feel it. Gives you a nice like protection layer. Nice. That's a good idea, William. Yeah, just remove the water however however you want to do it. Make sure you take the water out of your bottle sprayer, or your bougie sprayer, just so you know you have clean water in there, and also so no bat no bacteria builds up in there. All right, there goes that, there goes that splash. Of course, we have the EDP. Uh, gents, uh, this is still available. We have algorithm available at the wet shaving store. So we also have the EDP and there's only like four or five left of these. Uh, I'm going to spray some of this on me because I smell like a badass. And the EDP is really where all the money's at, guys. You want the full experience, 
and get the ADP. Armani code, it's about 90% there, 90, 95% there. Um, you won't go wrong. And at the at this price point, obviously, if, if you haven't tried Armani code, then you gotta get this. And we did ultra premium fragrance on this. If you guys don't, if you guys don't remember what we did, uh, Douglas, Embry, and myself were the hosts of the Shea Tech Show. Um, we actually put money up ourselves to make sure that we could get the most expensive fragrance oils that are available for this. That goes on the soap and the splash as well as the EDP. So just, just keep that in mind. What you pay for this set here, it's actually costs a lot more. We, we subsidize a lot of money just to, you know, give back to the community in that way. Um, and yeah, great stuff. Lasts really long because the fragrance, the quality of the fragrance is very robust. It's very nice. Uh, high quality uh, and just because it's here and I love menthol I'm gonna go ahead and hit it with that cremo um, that uh, post shave balm all right now I don't know if you guys have seen this this right here the cremo post shave balm normally if you go look for it on Target Walmart wherever I think it goes for like $8.99 um, you can get the whole kit the cream the balm and the razor uh, for $16.99 just remember to use the code Use the code CREMO when you check out if you get the kit um, and you get all of it. You get all of it for a really good deal. I mean, just the balm itself, actually the razor itself costs on its own um, what the whole kit costs. So we were able to source that for you guys. We give it to you guys as a deal. If you want it, take it. If you don't, it'll be there. And yep, great stuff. Real thing. There you go. That's what you do, Rob. Yeah, I know. I know. Well, shipping EDPs um, internationally is just, it's a pain, guys. I've done it. I, I, I did do it for some people, um, but it's a pain, and I get why we don't do it. Um, a lot of us don't ship it. When I say a lot of us, I think most of the retailers don't ship EDPs internationally because it's a pain. It's a real big pain. There's a lot of paperwork involved, and um, most of the carriers, the shipping carriers, they just... They won't take it. They won't take it. Um, so, you know, it has to be ground shipped and blah, 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 blah. Um, just to say, we're not doing it anymore. We're not shipping EDPs, but yes, we can we do ship splashes. Splashes can ship. Hey, Joe, what's going on from Soul Art Soap, guys? Sh Joe is there. Oh, by the way, if you guys haven't tried Following Seas, go get it. This thing is amazing. If you like blue aquatic fragrances, this is it right here. Showing it here. Showing it up here. Let me show you guys. Following seas. Make sure you guys get it. It's awesome. Awesome, awesome. The scent is awesome. So the, the soap, the splash, all that, obviously high quality. You guys already know they produce great soap. So um, if you're into green, I'm sorry, if you're into blue fragrances, aquatics, then it's going to be right up your alley. All right. Let's see. Let's wrap this up. All right. So if you guys are just joining in, you guys know I just did a live shave right now. Um, here's what came out of that. We're no longer using this anymore. Uh, this is Dunn Lather. We shaved with Algorithm from HCNC and Shave Tech collaboration. Scent is Armani Code. Smells absolutely fantastic. Um, and of course, I use my Mercur 34C and the Gillette 365. Try these out. These are great. If you haven't tried them, great little blades, guys. Great Gillette blades from India. All right. That's it for right now. Hey. And Shannon, what's up? Shannon from Elysian Soaps in the house. Get ready for that Tranquility Bay, everyone. Tranquility Bay is coming um, next week. Next week, Tranquility Bay and <laughs> Olympus. God, oh man, and my brain is just killing me right now. Olympus, guys, Olympus is coming out soon. I believe it's the 25th of August. Make sure you look out for that. Um, so great releases. Everyone makes great releases. Um, so support, support everyone. All right, guys. I'm out. Thank you guys for watching this video. If you're watching on YouTube, thank you guys for watching on Instagram. If you're watching live and we'll check you out next time. All right. Yeah. Thanks, Shannon. Yeah. Yeah. Have a great day. Have a great weekend, everyone. Peace.